Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to show you all of my pickups for the month of September, so stick around. Well, today's the day I'm going to show you all of my pickups for the month of September. We had a lot of releases during this month. It's only going to get busier from here, but really some really great looking titles. So I'm going to just get started. First up, I did get Bugsy. This right here is the Paramount Presents. Um, number 23 still haven't had a chance to check this one out yet but i really do love the slip on this one also from paramount presents we do have breakdown this right here is another great movie that i haven't had a chance to see yet everybody's talking about it but it is number 26 and then we got another vestron um edition this right here is dementia 13 director's cut still need to check that one out and then I ordered The Changeling. I heard so many good things about this one. This is a Severn release with this nice embossed slipcover. So I definitely wanted to pick that one up. And then another recent one from Via Vision. I did get the Space 1999 The Complete Series box set. I recently did an unboxing of this if you want to check that out. But this is a nice Blu-ray release from Via Vision <clears throat> in print television. Um, some other releases I got, or I guess I'll show you all of my Shout Factory releases. I did get this um, double pack of Dirty Mary, Crazy Larry, and Race with the Devil. Really do enjoy um, Shout Factory's double packs, Scream Factory's also. Then from Shout Select, I did get Oh God, The Collection. Really great films. I remember seeing these as a kid and really enjoyed them. So I'm definitely looking forward to revisiting those. And then I did get um, all of these new releases for these animated movies. I got Paranorman, The Box Trolls, Kubo and the Two Strings, and Coraline. So very happy to have those in the collection. I did get these directly from Shop Factory, so they did come with the lithograph. But I did notice that you can probably pick all of these up for around $15 each at Target, and I think I saw them at Best Buy, and I may have even seen some of them at Walmart. So some other um, some other releases, I have um, Alone in the Dark, Collector's Edition, really great release, Dark Spell, Dead Space, Bluebeard, Masquerade, Another Shot Select release, Havoc, Hunters, and The Vigil. And then from the Disney Movie Club, I did get some new titles. I got Something, Something Wicked This Way Comes, The Watcher in the Woods, and Flight of the Navigator. So very happy to have more releases from the Disney Movie Club. I really am enjoying all of these exclusives that they've been doing. Um, some other, I guess my Blu-ray releases that I got. I got Boss Baby. Um, this right here is the Target exclusive. F9 Target exclusive. I got the Woody Woodpecker Screwball Collection, which I'm really excited about having. Boys from County Hell. Violation. Till Death. I've heard a lot of good things about this one, so I'm looking forward to checking that one out. The Quest. Then I got this double pack from Mill Creek, Meet Joe Black and Wimbledon. And also Frost Nixon. And then I got Great White with this nice looking slipcover. A new A24 release, Zola. Profile. Catch the Bullet. Then I got the Black Widow Blu ray release from Disney Movie Club with a slip. And it does come with the red case, which is always nice. And twist. Okay, I'm going to show you my Blu-ray book releases from Best Buy, which was a busy, busy month. 
We got Unbreakable, F9. Really thankful to have Zack Snyder's Justice League in the collection now. Really love that still book. Also, I'm very happy to have The Thing still book from Best Buy. Another hard one to get. Black Widow. Shawshank Redemption. Vertigo. Rear Window. A Clockwork Orange. So another very hard one to get. I don't know, Best Buy was pretty much giving me um, heavy anxiety during the month of September. We had um, Zack Snyder's Justice League, A Clockwork Orange, and The Thing being released and being very, very difficult to locate those in store. And then lastly, I did get um, Three From Hell, which I really love the slip on this one and the artwork. Now from the UK, I did get some release, um, Some I did some pickups. I got the Goonies um, Titans of Cult set, which I've been keeping these sealed up, but I really do like the artwork on that one. I got from 101 Films, I got Suburbia and The Boys Next Door. And then from Second Sight, I got The Craze and Paranormal Activity. Love this film. And let's see, I got from um, Eureka, I got Universal Volume, Early Universal Volume 1. And then some more of the imprint line, I did get Drugstore Cowboy, Chinese Box, Days of Heaven, The Straight Story, Double Jeopardy, and As Good As It Gets. Really enjoyed these films. I was able to watch all of those um, from Imprint and very thankful to have those in the collection. Um, also, Masters of Cinema, I did get um, Johnny Guitar. I got Duel to the Death from Eureka. And then I did get Nobody on 4K from Zavi, the Zavi exclusive still book. Okay, now let me show you the 4K releases that I did pick up. I did get the Star Trek original four movie collection. Really love the box art on this one. They did a great job with this, so happy to have that one in the collection. I got the Target exclusive Black Widow, which was really difficult to find. And for whatever reason, it was they're all every one of them I saw in in the three Target stores I went to, they were all kind of messed up at the top. So I'm not sure if that was a normal thing for everybody or not. Um, I did get Cruella, which this right here was released last week, um, but it just came in this week. For whatever reason, our store, our Target stores here in my in the Atlanta area did not get any of these Cruella releases until this week. Um, I did pick up the Zack Snyder Justice League Trilogy. Really love the box art on this one. Um, I'm going to probably just keep this one sealed but just some really great looking box art. Okay, I got Rear Window. Vertigo. The Thing. A Clockwork Orange. Hansel and Gretel, Witch Hunters. Justice League, Zack Snyder's Justice League with a slip. Two Evil Eyes finally came in. I've had this um, ordered for a while from Blue Underground. and was finally able to get that one in the mail. And then I picked up the Transformers the Movie 4K edition with a slipcover. Unbreakable. Black Widow. And I got Cruella with the Walmart slip. I do like the variant artwork on this one. Plus, I did pick up just the regular 4K slip. So those are my pickups for the month of September. So it was a very busy month. I'm very thankful to be able to get all the items that I was able to get. Hopefully, you were able to pick up all the items that you wanted to add to your collection. Um, I know that October is going to be a very busy month, and so is November. 
Um, so I am looking forward to all of the new uh, um, all of the new items I'll be adding to the collection. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know if you were able to pick any of these titles up. And also let me know what you think about my particular pickups. I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and on TikTok. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.